Hi guys, I'm Mitchell Dale, joined by Martin Lenahan for RLW TV. Now, Canberra's short, sharp press conference last Sunday has us asking, what is up with that? Righto, Leno, you weren't too happy about Ricky Stewart's uh, early exit from the uh, from the press conference after the Raiders-Broncos game? Not a fan, mate, at all. Look, I'm just still trying to work out uh, a few days later what on earth he was so upset about. Nowhere near the worst refereeing performance of the year, that one. And frankly, Ricky, you've got to be better than that. There's other things to talk about in the game. If you're worried about the fine, you don't want to talk about the referees, tell the media. Let's talk about the players, talk about Brisbane's amazing try. Give your players a wrap, whatever you want to do. But you've got to be better than just walking out because you think you've got a dud deal. Yeah, I've got to go into bat for Ricky a little bit on this one. I mean, if, if you want boring press conferences, this is what you're going to get. If the, referee, if the coaches are going to go in there afraid to speak their mind for fear of a, of a, of a fine... This is what you're going to get. You're going to get 30 seconds and a bloke saying, well, that's it, I can't speak. I think uh, the referees have to be able to cop some sort of criticism. Coaches cop criticism. Players certainly cop a lot of criticism. Surely the refs are are big enough and ugly enough to to cop a little bit of criticism here and there and not affecting them too badly. Yeah, I've got to say, they do seem to be the only people in the game that aren't open to criticism. I'm sure they go back with Tony Archer and look for problems anyway after the game. So you are right to a point, I think, if we want... uh, coaches and players to be able to speak. Anthony Watmau said it very well. They're emotional. Let them talk about the game, say what they like. I still think, Ricky, fair enough. Leave the refs out of it. Don't don't take the risk of that fine. Tell us something, Ricky. There must have been something he wanted to talk about after that game. Yeah, sure. Look, I'm, I'm sure there was, and I'm sure he wasn't allowed to say it. Look, you, you can't go too far. You can't go questioning their intelligence or anything like that. Integrity. Call them a cheat, can't be doing that. Draw draw a line, but I'm sure you can just suggest that you weren't too happy with a few things because now we're all all trying to work out what Ricky was angry about. He would have been able to tell us if, uh, if it wasn't for these new strict rules from the NRL.